Idiophones are a wonderful amalgam of melodic tone and percussion. I've got a few of these types of libraries here from Sonic Couture, and they're great for when you need tonal percussion with a high polish. First up is the much loved pan drums. This library has been around for a while now and it's a commonly relied on source for a lush tonal percussive sound. You get five different styles of drum with mallets and fingers depending on the instrument.
You also get hand movement samples you can mix in and randomise to get that hands-on sound. And you can play them in their original tone. Or do your own thing. There's really no filler here, and it's great for ethnic and cinematic work. A real workhorse. Next is vibraphone. This is a great sounding vibraphone for flexible use, but it's also a one-of-a-kind library for this type of idiophone. Normally you'll get a vibraphone sampled with the tremolo motors off and the library will have an LFO that simulates the tremolo effect, which isn't very realistic. Sonicature instead decided to sample this vibraphone with the tremolo motors off both in the closed and open position, then used an LFO to crossfade between these two sample sets as you play which means you get the real tremolo effect, but you can also control the speed of the tremolo and every note will be in sync. That's pretty nifty, and the result is a quality, solid vibraphone library. Finally, we have Grand Marimba, which is a large, full-range, deep-sampled marimba.
This is an impressive instrument and was sampled with mallets for a warm tone, with sticks for a bright percussive tone, and bowed for an almost pipe organ-like sound. It's great for adding soft or percussive bass to your track, and it has a chocolatey tone. Sonicature have a knack for making expertly programmed libraries with high polish and I've never once come across any bugs or weak samples while playing their libraries. They make interesting workhorses that are always reliable investments and these three libraries are superb examples of that. That's that. The next library spotlight will be covering Sonicature's first fully fledged drum library, Moonkits. So, I'll see you there. Check you later. <laughs>